John Hancock here, and I'm here with my son Justice. You say hello. Hi. So we're here to talk about uh, classic video games you can play with your kids, and and I have many to share, and some of them are pretty straightforward, but there's some you may not think about. So I um <laughs> I introduced my son Justice to Pong a long time ago. It's a it's a classic. It's a pretty simple game. Essentially, you're using a knobs to move a bar up and down and uh justice what do you like about pong um it's like two um twizzlers trying to keep a sugar ball from their sugar castle thing <laughs> what an imagination of kids awesome next and i've asked justice i've asked this question several times to you what is your favorite game of all time pong it's pong but what's another game we talk about that's that's uh, one of your favorites? Um, it's um gunfight. That's right. My son loves this old handheld, and this handheld was made, uh, I do believe, in 1978. And gunfight is a classic. It's a classic handheld. It's a VFD vacuum fluorescent display, and it's showcasing two cowboys kind of shooting each other. And um, my son loves this game. And what's great about these classic handhelds is they they only could play one game. But it, it's vintage gaming, and it's pretty popular with with my son. What what else do you want to say about gunfight? Um, it's like they shoot peas at each other, and it's not the violentest I ever saw. All right, good game to play. Next, um, going a little bit later. Uh, Coleco did a series of these tabletop arcade games, and um, they're really very well made, pretty durable. Um, I had this one kind of restored with some uh, button upgrades. And Justice, what do you like about this? Um, well, it's not the biggest um, arcade machine, and um, and you could actually hold it in your hands like a DS. Yeah, and what's cool is, you know, as I showed, you know, I allowed Justice to go around in my game room, and these are some of the ones that he picked out saying, Dad, I really had a lot of fun playing these. And, you know, uh, these tabletop arcades are, are great little retro arcade experiences that you can show kids. Next up, you can't talk about classic video games without talking about Atari. Now, Justice... Um, I showed you Atari probably when you were like three. True. And do you remember what your first experience was on the Atari? Was Wall Jump on there? Uh, Ninja Wall Jump was a homebrew game. I did show you on that. But actually, your first experience was Space Invaders. And really? Space Invaders was a fun game. Uh, the reason why this is a fun game to show young kids, especially uh, kids younger than Justice, is it's a simple game. You're moving a, a ship back and forth on a screen, shooting shooting aliens coming from the sky. Very simplistic controls. This game holds up. It's still just as fun as it was to play back in the day. Another classic. You can't talk about Atari without talking about Frogger. What do you like about Frogger, Justice? Um, well, when the frog lands, um... He lets a, he accidentally steps on a barking spider. Oh yeah, I mean yeah, when a when a when a frog gets uh, ran over, it shows the crossbars. Yeah, um, different modes have different sounds, but yeah, the classic Atari Twenty Six Hundred Frogger is amazing. Um, there's also the Arcadia uh, uh, Starpath um, cassette version of arcade uh, the arcade version of Frogger. If you uh, for people with Harmony carts or something, that's another classic to play. And then, all, and then um, the granddaddy of all classics is Pac-Man. Pac-Man is a universal game to play with kids, easy controls. Justice, what do you like about it? You always have to have Pac-Man, and um, I think of it as a old cheese pizza with a slice taken out of it, and <laughs> you try to um, you try to eat all of the marshmallows. Yeah, so of course my son, who loves food, looks at Pac-Man kind of like a pizza, which ironically is kind of how Pac-Man was formed originally. So 
Uh, Pac-Man's a classic. Uh, you know, the 2600 one's a little blocky, but there's some homebrew ones that look more like the arcade. Uh, I absolutely think Pac-Man's a great uh, starter game for to show kids. Uh, the other thing to, to tell about Atari 2600 games is often a lot of the games have a children's mode, a, a teddy bear mode, uh, for early kids. And so it's also nice to, to put that mode on for showing them classics. Next, um, my son, when he started playing games more and more, he says, Dad, I want to show you, show me the one of the first Mario games. And I know that there was Mario Brothers Arcade, but when I showed him Super Mario Brothers for the first time, he really liked it. What did he like about the uh, the first Super Mario Brothers? Well, I can't really remember it exactly, but it's kind of like Ninja Low Jump, but you're a plumber and um, it's from a different system. Mm -hmm. Yep, showed him Nintendo and he's like, man, this is old and had a lot of fun. Again, a very classic game. Uh, easy controls, not a lot of buttons. Uh, you know, Nintendo has so many great games to, to, to play on. So, uh, next up is another game. And uh, it, it's not the original Donkey Kong, but Donkey Kong Country on Super Nintendo is a lot of fun to play. Um, Justice, what do you like most about Donkey Kong Country? Um, well... You try to stop a gorilla and there's fireballs at the bottom. Well, that's the original Donkey Kong. We're talking about the one you collect bananas on. Oh, oh yeah. It's confusing, um, see? You collect <laughs> bananas and I love bananas and that what made me kind of like it. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. This game is a little bit more challenging. Um, I do recommend this game over the original Donkey Kong for kids. Uh, the original Donkey Kong... Um, uh, arcade especially is a pretty challenging game and typically games last less than two minutes this one although difficult uh, but if they if they can play Super Mario Brothers this is another classic and uh, you know it's available on, on on many different formats so recommend it and then they get a little bit older and my son recently this last year uh, expressed to me that uh, he actually was a fan. I showed him Super Nintendo and a bunch of games, and I showed him Street Fighter 2. And what did you like about Street Fighter 2, son? Um, when I was sick, I thought, like, you could fight. It wasn't the violinist, and I just thought it was really cool. Yeah. Easy to play controls. It's, you know, the granddaddy of, of, of classic fighting games that were very popular in arcades. And it, it, it's a good game. Um, you know... Comment below. I want to know what you folks, uh, what class of games that you like to play with kids and, and ones that you want to recommend. And again, I want to thank you all the sus subscribers. I got a lot of great content lined up. And thank you for watching this video. And Take care. And check out my channel. <laughs> Have a good one.